guys, today I'm going to be showing you the parts of the skateboard. So today we'll just start off with the deck. This is the deck right here on top. Right here, um, this is this is where it's supposed to be graphic. But once you have Penny Australia, you will have it depending on what kind of board you get. If you got the marble board, you'll see marble in deck graphics. On uh, the original board, right here you got the grip tape. And right here, you got the layers of wood. And right here is your graphic. This is by Powell. So you know this is my friend Danny's. If you've seen my other videos, you'll know what Danny looks like. But for now, just, I'm just talking about the boards. Okay. Now, penny boards do usually um, share the same parts as a regular board does. But um, the only thing that's different, the plates, the hangers, or the trucks, the, um, the deck is smaller, depending on what board you have. If you have a cruiser, a long board, obviously longer trucks. But here, you just, yeah, the only difference. Okay, so on every board, you'll see that it has screws on top. Those are to hold your, your trucks. Right here, you got um, some screws right here to hold those screws on. So usually in the, you'll see grip tape, but on here, just the uh, normal plastic and the screws. Now we get onto the wheels of the deck. Now the wheels, let me show you if I can show you. Give me one second, guys. Now the wheels. This is a key tool if you haven't seen my video. Check it out. You just screw that off. This is a screw in, or if you must, a nut. Right here, you got your, um, you got your, what's it called? Your bearings. They're purple. You got them on both sides, and then you got the wheel. And then if you sometimes do, they'll tend to have a, washers or spacers right there at the bottom or on top depending on what board you have and then right here inside there's a little spacer because it's a penny board and all penny boards have the spacers now all wheels do have the um all wheels do have bear, uh, bearings, well, so so um, they all share the same pieces in the wheel. And usually they make it faster, you can unloosen it, so a little bit faster, but it may wobble a little bit, so be careful with that. Next, um, right here, you got another screw on or nut, and you've got these two. Um, king pins right here. These are king pins. This little flat part right here. And right here, this is a base plate right here. That's a base plate. Right here, these are hangers. That's what makes up a truck. Right here, I already showed you those are uh, nuts connected to the screws. So, yeah. Next, we've got the. So, to make up this truck. Uh, you actually need to um, take this nut off, take, uh, and you got a kingpin. And then you have washers right here, which are these black pieces right here. And those uh, help you turn. If you have softer ones, those are um, those will help you turn better. If you have harder ones, it will keep your trucks more stable for doing tricks. And um, a lot of people, um, sorry. So that's, that's my uh, friend's phone. And anyways, um, right here, it de it really depends on what kind of on uh, what kind of wheel you have, because usually um, the bearings, like I said, are usually um, a back nine is probably the fastest. It is the fastest actually. My friend has those on his board, and if you grab the bearing, you spin it. 
they will be really fast and so I have a back seven those are pretty good for pennies going down the hill that's what I mostly use it for and mostly for cruising and sometimes for school but anyways um on the hardness of the wheel if it's uh if it's um what's it called if it's not that hard if it's like a soft wheel like mine it will have way more grip to the ground if it's a harder wheel it may not have that much grip on the ground to the ground but what it will have it'll be faster so there's a um so there's a all the parts of the skateboard and so yeah uh that's it for this review later reviews will be coming soon hope you enjoyed I'll see you in the next video.